Using the library catalog is the easiest way to find out if we have print resources like books, magazines or journals, or media like DVDs, CDs, and audiobooks available in the library. If you're looking for journal articles or ebooks, you should try the library's discovery search instead. To search the library's catalog, head to the library's website. You could type the library's address in directly or click the link on the CCC homepage. On the library's page, you'll see a search box in the center. To search the library's catalog, click on the second tab that says Calib. The default option is to search by words anywhere, and that's a good place to start. For our example, we're going to search for things related to social media. The library owns over 350 titles related to social media. Each record contains an image of the cover, the author's name, the title of the book, the year it was published, and the call number. The call number will tell you if a book is located on the Auburn or Fulton campus. All Fulton titles have call numbers that start with Fulton. Auburn titles just list the call number. You'll also see the number of copies we own and a link that will tell you whether or not the book is available. The titles will automatically appear newest to oldest. You could click on the author or title to sort the results that way as well. To see more options, just click Next Page. You can scroll through the results to get an idea of the types of books that are available in the library. If you want to learn more about a specific title, you can click on the cover of the book or the title. From this screen, you can read the contents note to see what each chapter is about. You can read the abstract, which is just a summary of the book. And you can see the different subject headings that relate to the title. You may have noticed that some of the titles in our list don't seem to relate to the topic of social media. Because our original search was a words anywhere search, the results can have the words social or media in any part of the record, even if it isn't relevant to the topic of social media. For example, in this title about comic books, the words social and media are found in a chapter title about social change and digital media. If your original search is returning results that are unrelated to your topic, you can always change your search strategy. This is our original search. To get more specific results, instead of searching words anywhere, we can choose another field. There are options for title searches, author searches, or subject searches. Because we are looking for books in the subject of social media, we can choose a subject-based search. Another tip to reduce the number of results returned in your search is to put phrases in quotation marks. This tells the search engine to search only for the words together as a phrase instead of searching for the words individually. Using this strategy will eliminate many of the results from our initial search that had nothing to do with social media. If you would like even more search options, you can click on the Caleb link to go to the Advanced Search screen. From this screen, you can search for multiple terms at the same time. Let's say we're interested in learning about how social media is used in business. We can search for social media and business. You should notice fewer results when you add a second term. When we search for just social media, we got over 100 results. By adding a second term, we narrow our results down to only choices that are more closely related to the topic we're interested in. In this case, social media and how it affects business. There are a few more options that we can use to make our search even more specific. After entering our search terms, we can then limit by year of publication. Because social media evolves so quickly, we're going to choose to look for sources published only within the last two years. To do this, just enter the years you're interested in in the year fields. We're also going to limit by campus. By clicking on the More Collections drop-down box, 
you can choose the collection and campus you would like to search. Now we only get a few results, all of which are closely related to our topic, are recently published and available on the campus that we selected. To review, you can search the library catalog directly from the library's homepage by clicking on the Caleb tab, or you can click one of the links to go directly to an advanced search. A Words Anywhere search will produce the most results and can be a great place to get started. An advanced search is helpful when you're looking for something specific, want to search for more than one term, or want to limit your options to certain years, collections, or item types. If you have any questions about using the library catalog, please contact a librarian for help. You can stop in at either campus or use the phone numbers listed.